Mm. <sighs> I got my mind right. <sighs> I'm fully charged up. Shit. I'm ready to put on for the hood. Hell yeah, let's get it. Listen, if you are constantly distracted because you're on a constant pursuit of perfection, mm, nah, let me change that, rearrange that. Look, if you're tired of seeing all these perfect people on social media and on television and on YouTube looking so perfect, then you feel just like me. And you're definitely going to enjoy this episode of Attention Deficit Hood Analysis. Coming from where I'm from, I'm from... Man, I got this Anthony Hamilton song in my mind, man. Shouts out to Anthony Hamilton. What's going on, Hood Nation? This is the official phone blog, Attention Deficit Hood Analysis. I'm DJ Hood Shocker, the warrior with an intellectual master plan. And right now, I'm going to be talking about perfection. And I call this the illusion of American perfection. You feel me? I'm going to be talking about something that keeps bothering me. You know why? Because we live in a time where everyone wants to look like they got it all together. For me, it seems like everyone everyone wants to look like they have it together instead of actually having it together. People always say, fake it till you make it. Hmm. <sighs> How about you just make it and avoid losing yourself in the process of making it? You have to stay real so that you don't lose yourself because we're living in a time where people are so concerned about looking good, they don't want to show mistakes. They don't want to, they want to hide all of their insecurities. I was just having a conversation yesterday with one of my lady friends, and uh, she says, I'm the type of person that has high standards. Now, I know that she wanna paint a picture of being perfect because she wants to gain approval from people who know her. She's driven to be a person that avoids criticism. Now, she does not tell me this, but when I hear her say certain things, it translates into what do people think of me? Do they like me? I think it's a flawed attempt to make sure people have no, re no reason to criticize her or no reason to reject her. I hope that makes sense. You know, listen. Perfection is a level of excellence, like a top-notch level that no one can rise above. And I think perfection stuff is an illness. I think it's like a mental illness. Now, hypothetically, let's say you have a child. Do you ask the child what's his grade or do you ask that child what did you learn? See, this is a mentality that you must constantly analyze. Too many people measure their lives in terms of success and achievement and think that's living. Success, achievement, and living are three separate things. Just because you accept three as one does not mean that it's one. You understand what I'm saying? If you found a person that walks on this earth and they achieve the impossible state of perfection, you know what would happen? That perfect individual would be a constant reminder to you of all your flaws. What do you think will happen to a perfect person that walked on the earth? Well, let me tell you what would happen. They kill them. You heard what I said? They would kill them. But you don't agree? Well, go read the story of Jesus <laughs> or the person you call Jesus. I get so tired of watching television and girls get the perfect guy or the guy get the perfect girl. <sighs> I get tired of watching videos on YouTube and these people, they just speak all perfect. <sighs> oh, man, it, it, it really gets on my nerves, man. They intended they uh, they uh, edit the entire video, um, the, the, so that the video looks like they made no mistakes. I'm angry about these things because what it does it, it is that it promotes a lie of perfection. It makes people have problems with themselves because you're lying to them, acting like you are something that you truly not. 
I remember seeing Chris Rock do a stand-up special, and he was talking about this lady who was talking about she wanted a real man, but she had fake eyelashes, fake hair, um, she had fake titties. <laughs> She had all this makeup on covering up how she lived. Look, so she had a fake face, but had the nerve to say she wanted something real. The reality of today is that people all on social media, they post a life to project their life on other people. But what they're really doing is they're fooling regular people into believing into a fake world. Listen, in this world, you're either going to build or you're gonna destroy. You have to choose your path. You have only mentioned a problem. Uh, you know, no, I only mentioned this problem during this video, right? And I was taught to never mention a problem without pointing to a solution. So the solution to this fake world that influences you too much is to be totally authentic. You need to throw away the concept uh, that you think uh, no, no, no. You need to throw away the concept of how you think people want you to be or how they want you to act or accept you. You need to just accept yourself. Accept yourself. Be who you are. You are a person who makes mistakes. You are a person who has flaws. You are a person that forgets words when you're trying to create sentences. If anything you have learned from this phone blog is that I always be forgetting sentences and I always forget my words. Man, I be messing sentences up. You feel me? I'm telling you, I know how to fuck a sentence up. Holla at you, Lord. Look, every day you not popping. Some days you don't feel good. Some days you want to stay away from others. Some days you don't feel like fitting in. It's okay to be you. You are worth being yourself. Be proud that you are a work in progress. You and your personality is what make this world better. You feel me? So I had to just give you my peace of mind. This has been the perfect edition of Attention Deficit Hood Analysis. And I'm going to call this Straight Talk. I'm your man, DJ Hood Shaka. Until the next episode, you need to stay focused, stay real. Support the hood, stay authentic, be you, stay yourself. <laughs> Listen, man, it costs too much to be somebody else. So just be you. <laughs>